We're at Sickler's Bike and Sports Shop in Clark Summit this week with our David Kaplan. David, let's talk about Sickler's. You have two stores. What do you offer in these stores? Well, we're in Kingston, off of Wyoming Avenue in Kingston. We're here on Noble Road in Clark Summit, off of Winola Road. Uh, we here we have every variety of bike that you could possibly uh, ask for. We have road, a selection of road bikes, mountain bikes, uh, full suspension and hardtail. We have gravel bikes, cross bikes, hybrid, everything. We have helmets, pedals, gloves, every accessory that you need for a bike, we have it here. And you also get people out riding. So let's talk about some events that you guys run throughout the week. Well, on Wednesday nights, we have our beginner road ride, which we leave the shop here in Clark Summit at 530. We get up to 25, sometimes 35 people. It's a great event, and then we have a cookout out on the back deck here, on the front patio rather, and uh, everybody brings desserts and stuff. It's like a social event type ride, which uh, it's been very popular over the years. On also on Wednesday nights at Moon Lake, Dave Temerance, our general manager, runs a mountain bike ride at Moon Lakes. Leaves at six o'clock. He does that all the way in until the snow flies. <laughs> Uh, and uh, Saturday morning, as soon as the weather, as soon as it stops raining, will be uh, Saturday morning rides will continue uh, here from Clark Summit. At, we leave at 9.30 on Saturday mornings. And we also have a mountain bike ride when it stops raining at uh, Lackawanna State Park on Mondays. We leave at 5.30. Uh, our, myself and Herb Grayack lead the ride. So we're, uh, we've got a lot going on, and uh, we're gonna, we, we want to start more rides, but we're waiting for uh, Mother Nature to kind of cooperate. And when that happens, are you going to open up some different kind of rides? But why isn't it cool to get out with a group uh, to ride instead of just maybe by yourself? Well, on road riding today, road riding with people texting and, you know, the, the hustle and bustle of everyday life, it's good to be in a group. You're seen more. You're seen from a distance. And we always encourage everybody to put the flashing lights on the back of their bike. And if you're riding home when it's getting to be a little dark out, you got to get the front light on. you got to be safety first. got to be prepared of your surroundings. More popular, mountain biking or road riding? Um, right now, I'd say the most popular stuff around right now is gravel grinding. Okay. Dirt road rides. Yeah. Gravel bikes and uh, mountain bikes have been the, uh, the mainstay the last couple of years. And our plus bikes and our fat bikes have been uh, hot sellers. For the rides, we all gather here on, on Wednesday afternoons at 5.30, wheels are rolling. We have a nice crowd, like I said before, Saturday mornings once it stops raining. We'll be doing Saturday morning rides, and on we meet at Mondays at Lackawanna State Park at the main entrance. Herb Grayek or myself will be there to lead the ride, and on Wednesdays, uh, the headquarters down there is Moon Lake. Call the Kingston shop if you want to ride Moon Lake, and ask for Dave or Lee, and they'll tell you about the, uh, the rides in Kingston, about what rides we're going to have there, and Moon Lake rides on Wednesday night. And if you have a problem with your bike, you can get everything repaired right here, right? Right here. When we sell a bike, when we sell a bike, we make sure you come back so we can go over it again. We want to we follow up with the customer. We want everybody to have a great experience here at Sicklers. We have uh, four mechanics up here in Clark Summit at all times. We have two to three people in Kingston at all times. And we try to make sure everybody has a good shopping experience. So you have a demo fleet? Yes, we have a demo fleet of road bikes. We have a full size run of road bikes in our Clark Summit shop mm -hmm. and our Kingston shop. And we have mountain bikes in Kingston and we have one in Clark Summit. We also have a complete demo fleet of Cannondale Bad, uh, Bad Habit Carbons. Uh, Konas, and we have some Sosa uh, Pony Rustlers and Deadwoods, a full line of demos for those so you can come up and rent them for the day, try them out. And if you do, if you do like the bike and want to buy a bike and order a bike, we take the price of the rental off the new bike. So if I want to find out about Sicklers, where do I go? Uh, we're on uh, the web, SicklerBikes.com, or find us on Facebook. And come experience the ride. Hi, I'm Steve Kennedy from Bill McIntyre Chevrolet in Lock Haven, and today I'm going to show you the 2018 Chevrolet Equinox. The 2018 Chevrolet Equinox is a complete redesign. It features the 1.5 liter turbo, the 2.0 liter turbo, and the 1.6 liter turbo diesel engine. The 2018 Chevrolet Equinox features up to 63.5 cubic foot of space inside. It seats five people. It can feature leather seats, heated seats, navigation, Bluetooth, cruise control. It is capable with Android and Apple CarPlay. It's a great car for somebody in this area because it features the selectable all-wheel drive and front-wheel drive modes. You can toggle on and off on the fly, so if you're out there on the mountain or if you're on the road here on the highway. They all come standard with a backup camera, and it can also get XM radio. It can get up to 32 miles per gallon. The 2018 Chevrolet Equinox can feature plenty 
of safety features including side blind zone alert, adaptive cruise control, park assist, and forward collision alert. We have a great service department down here at Bell McIntyre Chevrolet. Every new car comes with a two-year, 24,000 maintenance program. If you can't make it here for your service appointment, we'll come and pick the vehicle up for you. That was the 2018 Chevrolet Equinox. We're celebrating our 40th anniversary down here at Bell McIntyre Chevrolet. You can visit us on the web at www.billmcintyre.com. Next on The Great Outdoors, we'll take you inside the Cabin Armory and Training Center.